Let's go ahead and try adding a new item for one of the other faculty members. I'm going to pick Catherine R. Spike, prof Assistant Professor of English. And let's reopen our spreadsheet just to make sure she's not already in there. Should have already updated the information from the changes that I made. I do not see her listed here. Just to make sure, I'm going to go into Wikidata. It does not look like Catherine R. Spike is in there. All right, does not look like Catherine Spike or Catherine R. Spike is in Wikidata. So I think we are fairly safe in adding her. Let's go back to the faculty page and copy her name to use as the label. She is an English professor, so let's use that for her description. She is an instance of human, so I can copy and paste this. And her sex or gender is female, so I can copy and paste that. And her employer is also Bluffton University, so I can copy and paste that. The reference URL, copy. And paste and then go ahead and put in today's date as the date retrieved. This will be converted into the format that Wikidata requires when it is uploaded. Now for field of study, we want to use English and we already have one English professor. So I think we can use Q1860, but we'll just double check. And make sure, yes, English, that is correct. And we can copy and paste the same reference that we used for the field of study. And paste it here for the reference URL here as well. All right, I think we're good to go. So I will save that and close it. And let's go back to the terminal window and run Vanderbot again. All right, it says it created a new record for Catherine R. Spike. Let's go in here and just check. Here we go, I just had to type it right. Catherine R. Spike, English professor, instance of human, sex or gender female, field of work English. Here's my reference, employer Bluffton University. So you can see it was, uh, took a little bit of time to copy and paste all the things in here. But as you can imagine, if you were doing a number of these at once, they would all share the same, uh, many of the same fields. For example, the um, reference URL and the date would be the same. So if you were going to create like 20 records, you could just copy and paste those all the way down the columns. And the only individual things you'd have to change would be the labels and then their field of study. So it should be relatively fast to create a number of items much faster than creating them using the graphical interface.